Alright, I'm back and before the video start, it's greatly appreciated when you want to rock. So please like, comment, and subscribe. So this video is about the baddies. Now, a couple weeks ago, or a couple days ago, I don't know how long, but Natalie and Tommy me they had that boxing match i think it's pretty safe to say somewhere between backstage and the ring something clicked in tommy and she just turned into like a crackhead or something because what, what, what the fuck was that now uh, if you watched it like the whole thing tommy was sober backstage well like not i'm not about because i don't know if she was under the influence but she was like real calm backstage she wasn't acting crackheady so i don't even know where it's like i don't know what happened like what the fuck happened if you don't know what I'm gonna I'm gonna post a little clip of her backstage if I could find it, but like she was normal, right? I can't find the clip, but take my word for it. She wasn't acting ditzy as fuck two minutes before she came out. I don't know what clicked. In my opinion, and like 99% of everybody else felt like the fight was fake because, I make it make sense, Tommy had all this coordination the day before when she snatched the wig off of Natalie's head, but now when y'all in the ring, she jumping around like a fish out of water. It don't make sense. It was really like all of the fights that she ever had left her brain. Like, you can't fight no more? Like, did y'all see the fight? Like, her head was getting knocked off her shoulders. So, every like, we've seen Tommy fight multiple times. Tommy never fought like that, which is why a lot of people feel like the fight was fake. Okay. And if I'm being honest, I'm not a fan of Natalie at all. I was, I kind of wanted Tommy to beat the shit out of Natalie. But honestly, I, I think I kind of like that Natalie beat Tommy because she was talking about that baby. You deserved it. <laughs> uh, onto the actual topic. So, Natalie, she went and did an interview with academics. Why academics? I don't know. I don't like that nigga either. Now, academics, like a lot of other people, felt like the fight was fake. Natalie said the fight wasn't fake. Uh, Tommy still in London sleep, some shit like that. Like, we basically talking trash, you know? And after that fight, Tommy was like, uh, checkers, not chess. Oh, wait, chess, not checkers. How much for the rematch? Some, something like that. Girl, sit down. You already disappointed all of us, pissing everybody off. We don't want to see no rematch. I want to see them fight with no pre-agreements, no contracts, which will be at the reunion. Tommy and Natalie, if y'all don't get it on at the reunion, the shit was fake. I don't care. It was fake. Anyways, after the little interview, Tommy, you know, she had some things to say. So first she said, this, um, goofy for real. She ain't get the memo. They told me you was crying and threatening to quit after I backhanded your silly behind. Now you want to do interviews. I'm a break contract. Let's go. Girl, what was in the contract? That's what we want to know. We've been... <laughs> Tommy also said, and the KO thing is a key. I fell out on the floor myself while getting water. Y'all funny, though. She then said, should have took that fake W and kept quiet, ho. Now you playing. The fake W? The fake W? Look, there's two things I'm waiting to see. It's Queen Up on the show and the reunion. That's what I want to see, Okay. Oh, Natalie, you know, she responded and she was like, see you at the reunion. Then she said, wasn't one thing fake about it. You capping, girl, you so mad, LOL. Now, here's the thing. Natalie is either telling the truth that the fight was real or she's confident in their contract that Tommy can't break. But Tommy just said, stop playing with her before she do break it. I'm here for it. Break the contract. <laughs> break it. So that bad boy's about to come out. I'm waiting. I want to see that. I didn't even watch the... Ooh, should I watch the first season of Bad Boys? Did y'all like it or no? Because if y'all say no, I'm not going to watch it. Okay, so that is it for this video. If you found it interesting, please like, comment, subscribe, share, turn your post notifications on. Thank you.